What is up, Wolfpack? I don't normally make these types of videos, but today is such an insane day for gaming news. I could not pass up the opportunity to make a video and let you guys know about everything going on today. It's pretty insane. So let's start off with Fortnite Creative 2.0. So Fortnite Creative 2.0 officially dropped today. I don't know all the ins and outs of it. I believe you have to use some sort of Unreal Engine editor on PC. I'm not sure how it's going to work necessarily on console though, but it will be utilizing all of Unreal Engine 5. You'll be able to script things and import custom assets and a whole bunch of crazy stuff into Fortnite and make your own custom stuff with it. So if you look at some of the images I have here, there's some sort of map that looks fantastic. And there's no HUD on, of course, so it looks really good. It looks like some sort of factory. It looks insane graphically. And then we have another picture of a mech in Creative 2.0 fighting a mech in an entire background that someone made that looks absolutely insane. Why is this so exciting? Why is this so cool? Well, that means you can go to Fortnite Creative and there's going to be some awesome, amazing, graphically beautiful and super unique levels within Fortnite from here on out. Of course, it's going to take a minute. Of course, of course, it might take a little while for there to actually be maps made since this just dropped today. But we can probably fully expect awesome looking and totally accurate Call of Duty Zombies types of custom maps in Fortnite and accurate and beautiful recreations of, of classic maps probably in the future as well. We're probably going to be able to see first person gameplay, we're probably going to get to see remakes of Halo within it, remakes of Call of Duty within it on maps and guns and maybe even in first person and that is just big news in of itself. And, but also we got an official reveal for Counter-Strike 2 in Source 2. They dropped a trailer showing off a bunch of crazy cool features, but honestly, I've never really played CS or CSGO, but they are dropping Counter-Strike 2 and Source 2. So it just looks a bit better, it looks nice, they're updating some stuff, and it's it's just, it looks awesome. Even though I don't really play CS, I'm genuinely excited for the people who do, and I may check out this 2.0 version. And for anyone worried, basically all your stuff from the original Counter-Strike will carry over to Counter-Strike 2, so your skins, your inventory, etc. But not only that, but all that old stuff, all your weapons, your skins, your inventory, it's all being updated with the new graphics and lighting. A lot of the overhauls and upgrades they're showing off look pretty beautiful. But, and if you guys haven't checked out the trailer for yourself, I recommend doing so because it looks pretty good. I'm kind of playing in the background here, but you can tell that it looks a bit better. It looks kind of like how Fortnite is right now. That's not a diss to either game, but you know, because Fortnite's actually looking pretty good as well. But yeah, it looks fantastic. And I thought I'd make this short little video showing off these two awesome new things happening in the gaming world to you guys for those that are interested. But let me know what you guys' thoughts in the comments down below. If you're excited, then be sure to smash that like button, subscribe for more gaming news and content, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.